What's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. We are back on Fight Night Champion Legacy Mode. As always, thank you for the massive amount of support on the recent videos. Um, last fight was a guy who had like a really high rank chin and we were like, okay, okay, here we go, here we go, baby. And we fucking smashed his face in. Um, I mean, we could probably run it back with Philbert Pep. It was a good fight. It was a that was a good fight fighting him. Anyone else we haven't fought before? We haven't fought these two. You know what? We'll give Lavar Ward a shot. He's 38 and 9 with 26 KOs. He's 4 and 1 in his last five with two KOs. So he's been the distance. Do you know what? We'll give him a shot. We are the champ. He deserves a shot. Um as always, training Mexico. And uh, yeah, he he deserves a shot, so I will um I'll give him one. You know, I feel like he deserves it. So yeah, let's um let's do this. Uh, we'll have a look at all the fight preview and stuff. And we'll train as always. I don't think we're going to be able to beat 91, 92 overall. I think we're going to be stuck there. I don't imagine unless I buy currency, which I'm not going to do. I don't imagine I can get 99 overall. Legitimately, I don't know if that's possible. We'll see, though. We'll see. We'll see what we can do. Um, you know what? We don't do this very often. Let's do stay on your feet. This is where we are completely weak and we have to not get dropped. I think it just goes round, 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 round. Uh, let's see. Stay on your feet. 10,000 points per round. Get Knock down your partner is 4,000. Get knocked down is 2,500. Okay. No worries. We should be okay. Our head movement's good, man. I, f I feel like we're, we're, we're quite skilled in, in our defense. Even though we never win defensive fire of the year. Maybe we take too many shots. Hmm. Maybe that's the problem. I don't know, though. Do we? Do we take a lot of damage? We need to look at our stats and say, do we take damage? Also, um, I can't remember the guy's name. Uh, so I do apologize. Let me see if I can find it quickly just between loading screens. I need to move my mouse with my other hand. Um, Eric M said, uh, right, do, said play UFC Undisputed uh, 3 on the PS3. Um, I would love to. I actually would. I thought, oh, that was this not good. This is not good. This is not good. Shit. It's fine. Yeah, he, he said, uh, he said to play UFC Undisputed 3. I would actually love to play that game. I loved it as a kid. Um, well, was I a kid? Was I, how old would I have been back then? How old would I have been? I can't remember how old I would have been. Yeah, I can't think how old I would have been. Pivot off, boom, boom. There we go. Yeah, I can't think how old I would have been, but... That was when you could play Pride as well, wasn't it? Um, because there was like 2010, 2011, 2012. Then there was UFC Undisputed 3. Um, and that was really good. I think, obviously, that was the, s the same video I was talking about doing... Um, same video I was talking about doing UFC career after this with the same character at the same age. He, he leaves boxing. Oh, this is not good. I'm rocked. I'm rocked. Move, move, move. There we go. Oh, fuck. I'm good. I'm good. No big deal. No big deal. No, I'm not good. I'm not good. This is a challenge. No. It's over. Not great. That's a tough one. I didn't have the feet under me to actually move properly. Bang. Yeah, see, I can't move properly. Oh, bloody hell. I'm going to have to meet him in the middle. Look how slow I am, though. Yeah, I can't do nothing except just move my head during this. Jesus. So, oh my god, we're not done? Can we just fucking end this, please? Can we just end this, please? I'm just, I can't do nothing, yeah? I'm fucking too slow. This is a stupid fucking challenge. Look. Look, I lean back. Look, it's not, look, if I, look, look, look. I can't even do a step back. So, look, my lean is that. So, if he, if he comes in with a shot, 
See? I don't have the... Look how slow I move. So it's like I could leave. Fuck that. That is fucking stupid. Your fucking mum is a whore. Fuck that challenge. We still went up to 85. We still double ended bad. That was fucking stupid. We know we have good head movement because we fucking we have like a top tier counter puncher when we actually fight. So I'm not I'm not accepting that. But um yeah, like I was saying, obviously someone probably said they said that maybe because they didn't want to see me play UFC three. I understand because UFC Undisputed three was much better. All the other UFC games have been much better in my opinion. Uh, UFC one and two are pretty eh. Average. You have to see three is probably the best one out of one, two, and three on next gen consoles. But other than that, man, previous gen console UFC games are so much better. Like UFC 2000, and, what was it? UFC 09. Right, UFC um, obviously 10, 11. I don't remember what else there was. 14. No, I wouldn't have been 14. That was PS3 days. PS4 days. Sorry. Yeah, I remember 9 and 10 and 11. I think. Was there 11? I don't think there was. I think that was UFC Undisputed 3 and that was it. Because I remember there was uh, Brock Lesnar on the front of one of them. Forrest Griffin was on the front of 09, I think. And Brock Lesnar was on the front of 10 or 11. And then Anderson Silva was on the front of UFC Undisputed 3. Um, so yeah, I remember that quite well. Um, but yeah, I mean, what do you guys think? I think I should just play UFC. I've got UFC 1, UFC... Two and UFC three on PS4. So it's a possibility. It's just I think UFC three is the better one out of those. But I don't have Undisputed three. I, oh, do I? Do I have Undisputed three? I might do actually. You know. I might do. If I do, I will let you guys know in the next video. Eighty nine overall. Fuck it, I'll take it. Like, what else can we do? Yeah, I'll take that. 89 overall. We'll see what he is. I can't imagine he's going to be much higher than 84, I would imagine he's probably going to be. 84 overall. Let's have a look. 82. Okay, he's had 48 fights. See, he's 43rd in the power pound ranker. That's not bad. I thought people worse than that. He's got a shorter reach, but he's taller. That's going to be bizarre. I'm going to be able to keep him at range, but I'm going to have to throw my fist up. That's going to be a bizarre fight. He's had nine losses, eight by KO. Oh, glass chin. Skills. He's got good hooks, good uppercuts, good body shots. 20 chin, that means nothing we've come to learn. And we have the same strength. Fair. All right, I rate it. Uh, what fight card are we on? Yep, and then we've got... Come on, lightweight. Oh, not a great MGM Grand. Not a great card, I have to say. Oh, I just realised. I might just... Okay, I just thought I was being stupid. I think I probably am being stupid to be honest. I think I've just realised something, but I'm not going to bring it up just in case um, I am being an idiot and you guys haven't noticed either. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Um, so yeah, we're going to jump into this fight. Obviously, I'm going to change my shorts as always, and I will uh, catch you guys in a moment. Good evening, everybody. Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, and welcome to the MGM Grand here on the Vegas Strip in beautiful Las Vegas, Nevada. The site for our championship fight. 12 rounds of middleweight action. Great atmosphere here tonight. You talk to everybody ringside, and they expect this one to be a barn burner. Young's really keyed in for this one. You can see it as he makes his walk to the ring. Yeah. 
His adversary, behind Sydney, I'm not sure if I fought this guy before. I don't know. It's hard to tell with generated characters. Remember, guys, obey my commands. His name I don't remember. Let's have a good, clean fight. Just gloves, bitch. Let's go. The opening bell of this scheduled 12 rounder here. A much anticipated fight. Round one underway. Well, this could come down to the disposition of each fighter. Get off me. Young's chances could depend on how he does playing that role of ultimate underdog and how his opponent does of playing the role of heavy favorite. Yeah, well, what he hopes right now is that his opponent takes him for granted. Oh, we're an underdog, are we? That's good to know. underdog, that's the benefit. You're not overlooking anybody. People think I'm past my prime, do they? So, Teddy, here we have a power puncher against a fast and speedy fighter. What are some of the first things you look for in a matchup? Well, I'm looking for I'll the fast guy to stay on the outside. When there's distance, you can use that speed. You don't want to be cramped where the other fighter can use his power. Damn it. Solid left hand to the head. And coming upon the halfway nice. mark of this nice. three-minute round. Nice block by Ward. And that's what fighters do. Pulls the trigger right away after taking one. All right, good up, Cal. That is exactly what the corner wanted to see. A good combination punch by Young. Dismisses his opponent's headshot. Okay. Bit of a slow first round, I have to say. A classic but... one two combo by Young. Come on, bitch. I ain't scared of you. Come on, you can't meet. Boom. 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 Yes. Yeah. Last 10 seconds of this first round. Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. Okay. And the bell rings, signifying the end of the round. The first round. Young's last round is a good example of what that. can happen when you just stay active. He threw more punches, he landed more punches. You can see the punch stats here. And it really paid off for him. Yeah, I can't believe I'm an underdog. With great power comes I've great never heard him say that before. And with great punch stats or high punch stats comes danger sometimes. Well, well I made that one up. I don't know if there's actually like saying it. for that. But that's where you gotta be careful. Yeah, the punch numbers are real high, but the more off, you throw, man. the more chance of somebody catching you as you're throwing. He has to be aware of that. Jump, jump, jump. Boom. Able to cover up that gut. Yeah, yeah. He's committed to the combination punching down. It's working out well up top. Locks that belt line well. He scored well after being Get hit off. himself. Bang. Bang. Halfway through round number two. There's the old one two coming after him. You ever seen that um that video? I don't know if I've better find it put it in the video. The side, oh, that's nice. Of the Floyd Mayweather fighting uh, Andre Berto. Um, yeah, it's like his 49th punches. fight before the Conor McGregor one. It wasn't as popular as the Pacquiao fight, but he was still there. <laughs> um, yeah, Andre Bert was popular, but yeah, he, he goes like 1, 2, and then he slips, and he goes 1, That's 2 again. Right, right, That's absolute thing of beauty. Look at that. Oh my god. What the fuck? Oh, that was kind of like a slip. It looked like a slip check, hit, but it wasn't. Hey, my dude. One, two, three, four, I gave him a lot of credit for even getting okay. up from that. Yeah, he was like, he, he was like, he what was it? It was like, uh, it was like, jab to the body, he hooked to the body, and he went to the side, he went jab to the body, hooked to the body again, and he got He just missed that shot Bang. up top. That's a good left hand by Young. 
Young's momentum now okay. could carry things. That Good was round. a strong That was a flash knockdown. That, knockdown. that wasn't him hurt in any way. Zoning in on that gut combination punch downstairs. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Keeps his hands up defensively, protecting the head. Young's at his best when the combinations are landing. He scored well there with that combo. This is just beautiful to watch. Watch how he just links one to the next, Teddy. A beautiful sequence, almost like musical notes being played. Well, exactly. It's a nice tune because it just follows. One, as you said, follows the other. Nice and smooth. <sighs> come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, oh. Hey, keep your hands the up. combo lands upstairs. Come on. with a good solid bang. uppercut after taking a shot. Slip, bang, bang. That's a forceful two-punch combo by Young. Young swinging and missing like he's at bat right there. That punch was nowhere near his opponent. Oh, you got this one. One, two, one, two. I give him, he's got a good block on him. I am hammering him at the minute. That's why they call the sweet science. Good work by Young. Yeah, real smart. Ward stumbled back. He just got hurt. Oh, what a left hand. You bitch. And round three comes to you an lucky end. Lucky fucker. Has really carried right, sorry about that, guys. So far. He's up three rounds to zip on your scorecard. Yeah, and again, that's bullshit. That. I, shot him, on, I caught him with that right hook at the end, but it obviously it registered, well, it registered it, but it wasn't going to drop him with no time left on the, the clock. I give him he's got good stamina. There's the combo to the body. Young's hand speed right now, the difference with what we just saw, able to land that combination. Yeah, he's probably going to need a little bit more down the road, but right now, that's got him in front. No, I think I could generally win a fight with nothing but speed. Let's see some Good solid shots with the combo downstairs. Not getting it done with that straight right hand. And that is why I unlock combinations. Good smart tactical move here, backing up his opponent against the ropes. Oh, good looking two punch combination by Young. That's how he's gonna play. I just fucking wait. He's committed to that left hand and it's working out. Get off. Get off me. Slip. Bang. to go in this round. Young so dangerous with that action. Cool, you see that. Four, four, four. Fuck, at the end of every round, I get like, get a momentum. Round really didn't do much for him. I just don't think he was busy enough. No, he His stamina's recovering really well. It's my only issue. Or not, he wants to be here. It has to change quickly now because if it doesn't, his opponent is going to kind of smell it a little bit and he's going to start pushing a little bit more and put him in bad problems. Good defensive skill with the block by War. <laughs> Teddy, there are opportunities that are here for him, aren't there? Yeah, counterpunch opportunities because he's got an opponent who's walking in a little bit. Now he has a chance to start do. to chuck something back at him a little. 
not able to land the headshot. Bang. Super two. Wards clearly affected. Big shot there. And once Let's go. again, he goes down. The question is, can he rise up again? Fucking folded his face. Who's bleeding? Am I bleeding? Oh, who's fucking bleeding? Climb back up that was the only time he's actually been hurt. No, he's been hurt a few times. I didn't know he was dropped. He was hurt. A little back, something back. for his opponent after getting tagged. Oh, that's how you do that shot. So then just the hook. Go over the guard. Bang. Now he's backing his man up against the ropes. He's committed to go into the gut. <laughs> Needs to improve that accuracy. Missed with the headshot. Yeah, give him a Keep moving. Keep moving. That was silly. I lent into an uppercut. <laughs> Young's combination punching is just perfect there. Three punches landing. Just 10 seconds to go in this round. Wards damaged by a right. Oh, a big shot comes home for him. Not saved by the bell, though. Once again, he hits the deck. Well, he's getting practice at it, so he might figure it out. I tried to hit him with this as well, but he was just out of my range. Mm, I don't think he's going to get up. This is fine. It's over. Jesus. Let's it's over. Go. The fight is over. Let's Young's go. Young's corner is already celebrating. His opponent unable to beat Was the I count. Beating? Who's the Nice and right. Wanted to hear those words, and he did. Let's and go. still the champ, defending his title. For my partner Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore. Thanks for being with Let's us. Let's go, baby. That's done. That's done. It was a good fight, to be honest. He put up more of a fight than I thought he would. You know, but. You know he deserved he deserved a shot. He's been on a you know he was doing well. He's got a, he had a good record. He was a four and one in his last five. Completely respectful, respectable. Sorry. So yeah, fair play to him. All right then, guys. Well, if you've enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe down below. We are now pound for pound rank number seven. That was our thirty seventh fight. So we have thirty eight fights. Um, will be our our thirty eighth fight will be next episode. Uh, and then yeah, literally like that is all we've got to do now. Forty fights, forty five fights, fifty fights. And yeah, madness. Um, am I able to? Where is, because we said we would check it, where is, should be on rankings and awards, punch stats. No, it's not there, is it? Where's the, the big thing? It, like, my legacy. My legacy pro progress. Should be here. Here we go, punch totals. Does it say, punches taken? See, that's it, bro. That is it. Why did we take so many punches around that time? <laughs> it literally skyrocketed at one point. Um, where do we take most of our shots to? Our jaw, obviously. We take a lot of shots to the right cheek. Okay. General body punches taken. Four per fight. Solarplex. I've never actually been fucking hurt by any of these. I averagely take 23 punches a fight. How many punches do I give? Wow, you can go through each individual fight. 
can you go through each individual fight? That was May 10th. Crispin Pierce. I beat him by round 5 KO. Why did I take so much fucking damage? <laughs> but anyways, this is going to be for another video. This is going to be... A, we're going to go through all of these in another video. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed, be sure to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe down below. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.